Vikings. Hi there and welcome back to the channel! Alright Rand, so for today's video we're going to be Vikings. And I don't just mean any Vikings, I'm talking about the amazing TV show Vikings. If you haven't seen it, please go watch it. It is amazing. So I get super inspired by all of the different hairstyles and looks they have on this show, which are so beautiful and so badass. Like, don't you just want to feel like how they look? So I decided to recreate them for you and make a tutorial on it. A note on this, in the show, everything is definitely almost 100% historically accurate. I've read it in several sources. Now the way that I'm going to do this will not be historically accurate, but that doesn't matter. It's still gonna look really great and it's gonna be super easy for you guys to do. If you don't already know me, my name is Manuk and here on this channel we do hairstyles. At least that's what we've done so far. So. Please enjoy the ride, and if you like hanging out here, then click that subscribe button. So, without any further ado, I hope you enjoy it, and let's make some magic! Alright everybody, so we're ready to create the look to go on the most epic battle of our entire lives. So we're going to start off by obviously taking our hair down and making a side part. Make sure it's a clear straight part. Now we're going to section off that part into two, making sure there is as much hair on one side as the other. When separating the curls, please do this carefully. Then start twisting it really tight towards your face really having it sit tight on the scalp. Sometimes you have to redo it to make sure that it's really tight. If you want to use some product here, then that is also recommended. Then take a bobby pin, pin it away half, and then turn it upwards and slide it into the twist. So it's really going to sit at the scalp and the twist, holding it together, just like so. Then do the same thing at the upper side. So we're going to take it, twist it super tightly, really starting at the front and twisting it all the way towards about, I would say, half of your skull. So we're taking the bobby pin, put it in halfway and then turn it upwards and slide it into the twist. Then take the hair that is sticking out of your twist and divide it into three strands. We're going to be doing a regular three strand braid, which is super easy to do. And now when doing this, make sure you do a loose braid. So don't braid it super tightly because you still want your curls to look nice once you take it out. Really do braid all the way down till the end so that your hair won't need an elastic and it will hold itself in place. Do the same thing on the upper twist. And that is it. You are more than welcome to add some embellishments if that is something you want. Now for our second look, we're going to be looking at the section and creating the exact same one on the other side. So separate your curls with care. And then start by taking the upper portion of your hair and taking some hair from the back and tying that off with a hair elastic of your choice into a ponytail. Make sure this one sits pretty tight. Then fluff it out as how you would like it. And we move on to sectioning it off into two parts. So we're starting at the bottom part, twisting it very tightly at our scalp towards our face. Take your bobby pin and secure it in place. Mm -hmm. 
And then we're doing the same thing at the other side, really twisting towards that end and then making sure there's no hair tangled in between. And we're taking a bobby pin to secure that in place, making sure it will last all the way through your epic battle. So now take your hair section again and make that three strand braid all the way down till the end. I think for this style it could also be really cute to like embellish it with some rope or maybe like with some colorful yarn or anything like that but for now I just wanted to keep it simple that's why I didn't do this but be my guest and go really all creative on it. So again for the upper twist we're also going to be doing a three strand braid all the way down till the end making sure that it will hold itself in place so you don't need any elastics. And there we have it, that is look two, all ready to go. For our third and final look, we'll be fluffing out the front section of our hair a bit. And it's going to be some sort of an updo. Now take that ponytail, flip it to the front and then section the rest of your hair into two. Now take one section, leaving out the braids, and make a similar twist as we did before, but just a bit more loose. So we're going to be twisting and folding under, making sure it kind of sits in place. No worry about this going perfectly. Now here I'm just taking a bobby pin to make sure it doesn't fly away as I'm doing the other side. So take your other side and also twist and fold, twist and fold. Then take it out, take all of the hair, so you're taking the twist and your ponytail, to create that together into a bun. I didn't want this to be too big, but not too small either, so I took quite a bit of a time to model it into the way I like. I will spare you the footage of that. Now secure your bun in place with some bobby pins all the way around. Now take your braids and put them to the back. Join your two upper braids together, forming them as one, and make a three-strand braid with your middle braid as two braids together. And make sure to also do this all the way until the end so it will hold itself in place and won't need an elastic. And there we have it, that is look three. Alright, so here we have our Viking looks. I really enjoyed making these styles. They're super wearable and you can really wear them on a day-to-day -day basis. So you can look casual and fancy but also always be prepared for battle. I really got inspired by the Viking looks that we see on this show and I kind of created a simpler version on it. I hope you enjoyed creating these styles and finding your inner Viking warrior. everybody so that was it for today we did three viking looks and honestly i feel pretty badass right now like i could go into battle at this point it's yeah if you recreate this style or any of my other styles i would love 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 to see it and you can do that by making a picture and posting it on instagram using the hashtag make magic. I would definitely love to see what you guys create and if you have any other suggestions on what I shall do next then please leave those down below in the comment section. Uh, let me know any historical eras, any cool TV shows, any Disney princesses. I am very excited to hear about them. If you like this video and if you liked my channel then please do give this video a good old like and hit that subscribe button it's about it's about right here you can you can click it and uh, ring that notification bell so you never miss a video I post videos every Sunday I look forward to seeing you have a magical weekend until next time <laughs> <laughs>